Hello and welcome to Maxwell's Can Do Island Clubhouse, which is a part of the I'm Possible and Can Do Island series where you can be and do anything. Today, Maxwell's adventure takes him to Africa for the African American Read In. Our guest reader is Mr. Sherman Denby, and he will be reading He's Got the Whole World in His Hand by Kadir Nelson. The author uses an old spiritual that Mr. Demi will share with you later to bring his book to life. It's a springboard to celebrate family, togetherness, and each line of a four verse version of the lyrics caption an intimate scene of an African-American lad, which means a little boy, his siblings, one lighter skinned, perhaps adopted, and two parents in various combinations in the city, San Francisco, in country settings, sharing the moon and the stars, the wind and the clouds, the oceans and the sea, and so on. He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got my brothers and my sisters in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the sun and the rain in his hands. He's got the moon and the stars in his hands. He's got the wind and the clouds in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the rivers and the mountains in his hands. He's got the oceans and the seas in his hands. He's got you and he's got me in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got everybody here in his hands. He's got everybody there in his hands. He's got everybody everywhere in his hands. He's got the whole world 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 in his hands. He's got you and me in his hands. He's got you and me in his hands. He's got you and me in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands by Kadir Nelson. This episode was brought to you by the Bridgeton Municipal Alliance Youth to Youth Program, providing drug-free, violence-free and bias-free choices since 1991.